Thank you. Now let's have our applause and we celebrate the Hills Live. Battling in that far corner, coming low to pick it up. Is Alessio, and he starts up ice for the Blaze. Takes a big hit from Ben wow. Lake. Well, awesome hit. Love that's to see a it big hit. Now to the blue line. Roth settles things down. There's a chance back up, but a long stretch pass to McNulty. McNulty now sends it far into the opposite corner. Kept in at the blue line, across to Kukwali. Kukwali sends that goal, but it's right on the doorstep, and Jackson Whistle with a huge save. Unbelievable save by West. Good read there by Luciani. Nori again always looks for that quick pass up. Now it's away for Curran. Curran tries to get around. Curtis drives the net and ends up with Jackson Whistle deep in his own net and looks like it's going to be slow to get to his feet. Two teammates, two ex-teammates colliding. Yeah, I'd be unhappy if I'm seeing that on the ice, but I, I'm not sure what the uh, ruling is there. If, if I don't think he was pushed into the goalie. Is it up to Curran alone to get out of the way? You have to see uh, what the referee uh, calls here, if he calls anything. Again, the Blaze send it out front. That comes off the side of the net. Now there's a chance here, trying to kick it ahead and in all alone. But again, the good defensive play on that occasion. But heads up by Will Cullen. I don't think he heard me, but he managed to get his head up <laughs> just on time. McIntyre steps in. I heard you in my left ear pretty good. Sorry, man. <laughs> right behind, but, you know, it, it literally, you usually hear a little bit of a cry going heads up, but nobody, I couldn't hear it from here. A shot tipped in front, rebound at 10, a second rebound, and Cozen stops all three. Nourish finds Thompson. Thompson with the shot tipped in front. What a save from Jackson Wessel. Rebound, and it's 1-0. Mitch Cook. Puts it home, the Blaze fans down to our right-hand side are up on their feet, and Coventry have a 1-0 lead. Yeah, that all started from that nothing play. Guy comes down, I think it was a one-on-four on Belfast. He was able to get that shot off from the blue line. And then uh, all that ozone period, uh, sorry, that whole ozone shift ended up resulting in the, in the goal. Just good movement. Uh, ended up keeping us tight. We're a team that has to keep pressure on uh, teams when they're in the Ozone. As soon as we lose that pressure, we, we give them too much space, and that's where shots like that can happen. It's dangerous, especially with those rebounds. Clements chips a deep. Carter Allen under pressure from Oliver Cooper. And I, the speedster, gets it out front. Was McLeod. Sato can't capitalize. And Kirkup manages to take it clear. His pass is a bad one. Sato turns up ice. Kohei Sato, little chip in. Oh, what a finish! Awesome. McLeod. With a lovely dish from Sato. And Matt McLeod ties things up. It's 1-1. One, one. I felt it coming, if I'm being honest. We had a, <laughs> all ozone shifts there. It was great to see after the goal again. It's great speed again. This is our two speedsters on the team. Sato coming in. Defenseman had no choice but to drop there and just left McLeod wide open for a lovely tapping. So great play all around. A lot great of speed. Bit. Yeah, great dish by Sato. And Matty McLeod gets his 12th of the season. And it's tied up. Being able to make plays at that speed is not an easy task. It was great. Great pass, great finish. Little dish back down low again for Lake to spin away from Luciani. Once and twice, gets it out front. A shot from Kieran Long blocked in front, and it's home, and it's 2-1. Belfast capitalizing on the mistake. Behind the net. Must be hard to breathe being that Coventry defense right now. We're just absolutely swarming them like a blanket. Sedesco taking the plotters from that one. Yeah, it doesn't look like much of a shot initially, but great job by Tedesco for palming that down and getting it, getting rid of it. That's Daniel Tedesco's 20th goal of the season. <laughs> and they take the lead 2-1. Fortunately for him, it was a good defensive play by Cook, who tied him up against the wall. But it's a turnover once again by the Blaze. Tedesco, with a bit of space, hits the shot, but it comes off the blocker of Cozen once again. The Blaze have had so many turnovers in the second period. Yeah, I think, it, again, it comes from that aggression on our offense and our, uh, sorry, our offensive zone forecheck. Uh, we take away time and space. Chance for a two-on-one. Judak with a shot. What a save from Jackson Whistle. 
He didn't hold on to it, but he made the stop. Big opportunity there for the Blaze on a two-on-one. Cullen with the blast, tipped in front. And the Giants extend their lead. Blake Spears with a redirect, and it's 3-1. Fantastic tip, great shot. Awesome play off the face-off. Jacob Friend gets it back to Cullen with a one-timer. And that's a great redirect by Blake great Spears. Redirect. His third goal in a Belfast Giants uniform. Yeah, that's fantastic. It's a, such a simple play off the faceoff. D to D, one-timer with a drive the net, and uh, look what you get from it. And Jacob Friend, little give and go. Now he drives down this left side and cuts to the middle. Friend lays it off one time. Oh, what a shot! Ben Lake. Lovely little drop pass from Jacob Friend, his second helper of the evening, and it's 4 1. That's just class. What a play by Jacob Friend here. Driving a deep cutting in the middle, like we said here. And then a sneaky little dish back to Lake, who's just coming down Main Street, can absolutely torque it, top right corner. That's just beautiful. 46 21. Carmichael plays, you're just sitting there, and <laughs> what can you do? Yeah, that was a bullet. Throws one off the back wall. McNulty ahead to Roth, who has to slow up as Blake Spears was closing the gap down on him. Friend being given chase by Christo. Again, more speed from Belfast through the middle to McIntyre. McIntyre around the outside. Bobby McIntyre sends it on target, and it's home. That's going to be waved off. Yeah, and oh my, get and in A little there. bit of afters here. So, Norris jumped on top of Bobby McIntyre as they drive the net. There's no difference in that. I've seen, that's the exactly end. what I was going to say. That is picture perfect what happened in the first period. Yeah, it's exactly the same, but yeah. Norris. But, but that one didn't result in a goal, so yeah. there's going to be a bit more. Uh, so we'll be interested to see what the call the is here. The, uh, what was the call on the ice? There, was, were, there was no call on the initial contact. See, Kieran Long is trying to point out to the referee that it's exactly the same play as what happened yes. at the other end of the ice, but he's no attention. There was no call made on the initial play, so it's it, it seems. Uh, so it's been waved off. It was put on by Nazarian. Now, rightly so, I don't believe it should be a goal. No, I completely it's agree. Got a, yeah, it's, it's, it's a no goal, but there's no difference in that no, it's, than what it's there was at the other end of the ice. Yeah. Dudak, to the point. Hart steps in. He's got a man coming off the bench. A shot, good save by Jackson. Rebound attempt, picked up and cleared by Belfast. Great stick by Wiss there for the second rebound, just getting it out of the out of the reach of Contra Blaze player there. Cooper takes a hit. Little drop pass there from Lake. Across to Tedesco, what a shot and a great save by Cozen. Bobby McIntyre, McIntyre, little drop of the shoulder into the zone. He's got fresh legs coming off, finds across to Nazarian. Nazarian with the shot, paddle save by the goaltender. Good play by Spears, he's feeling it tonight. Nazarian, back to Spears, now across to the top for Cullen. McIntyre to Cullen, Spears. One-timer save, rebound attempt, couldn't be put home. Back door, another chance, and another save by Cozen. This is better from Belfast. McIntyre steps in, takes a shot, rebound, it's right on the doorstep, and again, help to safety by the Blaze. Johnny Despite. Curran chips it in behind, Roach finds Baum. Back off the wall, to Oliver Cooper. Cooper now thinks about it, and bounces in the center ice. Koei Sato! Wow. A little bit of luck going your way. Well, you Koei know, Sato oh, finishes it off, yeah. Oliver Cooper, he always makes the right play, you know, right there. Getting it deep was the right play, and by chance, you know, you're going to get a lucky bounce every now and again. That was maybe very lucky to bounce straight in the slot of Koei Sato. And then to get that release on the puck that was bobbling as it was. Yeah, it's like a knuckleball. Uh, that's fantastic. Um, so, yeah, def I, you know, I'm watching that. There's definitely luck involved, but great finish nonetheless. Baum goes across ice for McIntyre. McIntyre into the zone, but 
just hit away from him by Luciani. And a big hit there in front. And um, one of the players is... Oh! One of the players on the bench grabbed Bobby McIntyre. Can't do that. They grabbed him on the bench. I don't know if we've got a replay of this one. Bobby McIntyre being taken away. <laughs> yeah, one of the guys on the bench grabbed And then David Clements came in and ended up punching the back of the head as well. McIntyre stays where he is for the second. 50 seconds to go. Yeah, you can't be doing that from the bench, but I, uh, I do know Bobby ha finds a way of getting under players' skin. <laughs> yeah, he's really good at that. <laughs> I love that part of his game. Oliver Cooper positioned at the top of the blue paint. Back to Roach. Back to Tedesco. One-timer just wide. Goodman can't keep it in. You can see him throwing the head yeah. up there. Yeah, well, you just want to have a bit of fun with 30 seconds left up a man. You want to get some confidence, move the puck around, see what happens. Well, the seconds are ticking away here at the arena in Belfast. And they're going to hold on to this behind the net. It's been a solid performance here at the SSE Arena tonight by the Belfast Giants. Great game. Luciani looked to step in on Josh Roach. And as the horn goes here, a 5-1 victory in the first night of the doubleheader against the Coventry Blaze. Belfast Giants have goals from Macken and McLeod. Tedesco. Blake Spears, Ben Lake, and Kohei Sato. They've got to do it all again tomorrow night. Seven o'clock face-off. You can't get to the arena. There are tickets still available on Ticketmaster.ie, or you can join us on Belfast Giants TV tomorrow night from 6.50 p.m.